Hello there, everybody! Ice Christ here, and welcome to RimWorld! Now, um, if you guys remember rightly, back in it was either the old channel or this channel, I used to do RimWorld! It was a, a, a very short series, um, but I, you know, it was good fun, and I thought now that they've updated it again, I may as well give it another go! So, here we are! Um, this is going to be, uh, this music is so fucking good. It's like really loud in my ears as well, so I'm like, whoa! Anyway, so yeah, um, we're going to be doing Randy Random. So he like throws really random shit at you. It can range from really good to really, really bad. And it can come like, anytime, anytime. And uh, because we're a good guy, we're going to go with rough, you know, kind of kind of simple little start there. And it'll be good, it'll be good. Um. So yeah, this is gonna be one of those thing, one of those series. I believe this is my new one here. This is gonna be one of those series that I take time. Oh, okay. I guess that the, this is not the world that I rendered. Okay, so we have our three starting characters. We got Bernie Burn, who was a sickly child at heart. However, he will be our grower medicine man and handyman so he'll basically be able to do a lot of stuff then we have devil girl uh, also known as sarish who you know used to be a cave world turn lord she's gonna be our main miner you know and she's also gonna be kind of you know she'll do a little bit of construction here or there that burny burn cannot handle then we got cold heart who is awesome in every way okay um it was master group He's going to be our chef. Now, he's going to be mainly chef, but he'll also be our shooting individual who will go out and murder things. So, without further ado, let's get started. Alrighty, here we are in the world of, uh, well, in the world of RimWorld, I guess. So, let's pause it real quick and let's take a look around at what we got. So, we got all this down here, got this huge area. Um, looks like we got geezer over there, which would be very useful. You might want to go for that. Uh, so is there any more geezers around? Uh, doesn't look like it. So, it's decided. Then, I guess, we're living down here. Next is geezer, because the reason why we want to live close to the geezer, and also in this area, is I can build my base inside the rock, fairly simply. And, you know, we've got some resources over here that we're going to go ahead and unblock. Got some resources down here. Holy crap, that's a lot of starting resources. That is insane. We're going to be really well off straight away. And, of course, Cold Heart is our best sniper. So, we're going to get him to equip the survival rifle. Bernie Burn will equip the pistol. Actually, no, no. Uh, Cold Heart, yeah, Bernie Burn, you'll get the knife. Uh, Devil Heart will get the pistol simply because that's the way it is. So uh, I'm gonna go through all the basic first starter thingies. Um, you know, clearing up all the blocked items so they can be hauled when needed. Oh, there's another Bernie Burn thing up there, uh, but we don't need it just now. So I'm gonna get through the starter stuff and um, yeah, we'll see how, where this takes us. Work is well underway on our little base here. As you can see, I have. Devil girl mining. Bernie Burns hauling and chopping wood, ensuring that we have enough stuff to actually build with. We also got some food here, and Cold Heart is a way off doing his job hauling shit in. So, yeah, all in all, we're doing fairly well so far. Um, what I am going to do, poor Cold Heart's just collapsed with exhaustion. What I am going to do right now, though, is I'm going to go ahead and go to Architect. I'm going to put uh, power, and we're going to put on a. Oh. Oh, okay. What is this? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, Cold Heart has hypothermia. <laughs> okay, you uh, go rescue Cold Heart. Um, wow, this has changed a lot since I last played it. Okay, let me go ahead and build a bed in here. We're going to need a wooden bed right here. Um, so, yeah, the, the game really has changed since I last played. Uh, before, there was no such thing as hypothermia. Uh, Bernie Burn, go rescue him. Okay, you hurry up. Build it, build it, build it, build it. Cool, okay, and let's go ahead and set that as medical. Bernie Burn, rescue! Uh, set as non-medical, maybe? Uh, rescue? There we go. Okay. So that'll, 
Oh, hello. Everyone knows me. Don't let it say in this rock for long. But Cold Heart suggests you give the call in a name anyway. He's probably rambling in his, you know, sleep of cold death. Uh, what should it be called? Hmm. Let's call this the Town of Doom. Because we're all doomed. You know I mean? It's kind of obvious. All right. Cool. Okay. So, whilst he's relaxing, you know, sleeping away the daytime, I'm going to go ahead and make two more beds. And, um, yeah, let's let things keep rocking and rolling! Okay, so what I have realized is that now they have temperature in this. So, say for example, uh, where's my water? There's my water. Okay, so Cold Heart right here, he's hypothermic, okay? So, he really needs to be heated up by this indoor heat spot, which I have put in, you know, and hopefully that's a, a severe illness. Okay, Barney Burn, you must prioritize healing! Why can't you? I guess I can prioritize the cleaning of blood off of him. Uh, why can't he heal? Is there anybody I have that can doctor um, Barney Barn? But apparently he cannot heal him. Let's take a look. Uh, people are at risk. Make sure they get the best medical attention possible. Health. Um, he's got <laughs> he's got frostbite on his fourth left toe. Okay. Uh, hypothermia. He's got full hypothermia. Uh, food, he's at 48%, pain, oh, he's kind of in pain, wow, wow, whew, I didn't realize I was 77 years old, okay, wow, let's continue, boom, there ain't nothing we can do for him just now except let him kind of heat up there, uh, let's go ahead and set these guys to haul all this, hopefully I don't die, I mean, that would suck if I died, like, right in the beginning of the game, eh? Uh, where's my hauler? Where are you? Buddy! Buddy! Whoa, um, oh, he's fully healed, apparently. Hi! How are you feeling that? Okay, so he still has extreme hypothermia. But hopefully this fire will help him out. Uh, let me see, is there anything else I can make? Maybe build to- No, he's got hypothermia again. Great! Is there anything I can actually build to help him? Maybe a heater? Um, that requires power. Uh, god damn it. Okay, you. Rescue. You. You're incapacitated. Okay. So what I really need to do is I need to set up some kind of power supply. ASAP. So, let's... God dang it. Okay, devil girl. Heal. Okay. Let's set up a power source. Okay, so power. We're going to need a wind turbine. Right there. Okay, so that should do it. We'll get, uh, where, where, where is she? Uh, girl? Where did she go? Yo, devil girl. What the hell are you punk ass doing? Get prioritized working on this. Keep working on it. Keep working on it. God damn. It's, yeah, they don't, they don't do it the first time. You just gotta keep doing it. And God damn it, build it. Thank you. Okay, so we now have a windmill. Um, apparently it's being blocked by a tree of some kind. Uh, blocked by poplar tree. Maybe I put that in the wrong place, because it's not spinning. Hmm. Oh my god, cold heart! <sighs> okay, we might lose here. It's just because cold heart's being a dick. Um, let me see, uh, temperature, let's put the campfire right next to him this time, burning burn, prioritize, uh, devil girl, prioritize. Okay, so, it's definitely windy, this ain't doing shit, so I'm gonna go ahead and deconstruct it, get all my resources back, and, uh, we'll move on from there. You, go deconstruct, oh wait, oh no, no, it's still need deconstructed. Um, devil girl, devil girl, deconstruct this bitch. Why can't I use this anymore? What can I use on that? I used to be back a while ago that you could actually put a, um, what's it called? You could put a, a, a sort of like a thermal generator on that. Hey! Don't you dare. You. Prioritize. You. Rescue. Can you prioritize? Okay. Yeah, good. What's this? Oh, oh, hello. Hi. So what are you? You are a constructor. Oh, I need that. Okay, um, so I need, uh, I think it's a prisoner bed I need. I can't do it right now. God dang it. I keep getting distracted by cold heart. 
You know, it's kind of difficult to do shit like that. Okay. We'll leave it like that. We'll just let that person die. We will continue. I'm sorry to say I lived a good life. I was 77. I died. <laughs> I did not last long in this series at all. <laughs> this is probably what would happen in a real life scenario as well. So I buried myself. That is unfortunately the first death. But we do have Devil Girl who has come to join us. <laughs> uh, well, not Devil Girl. M. That's her name. M. So I'm hoping she'll heal up. And uh, let me just go ahead and do. Is there any guest? Here we go. Gets medicine. Dog scare. Gets food. Hopefully she will be taken care of. Where are you? Bernie burn. Sorry, man. Uh, let me see. What's your trying to help that? Uh, you need some food. I'll let you get some food. Okay, cool. And if you're gonna go, are you gonna clean her blood off, I guess? Alright, leave it there. Let's keep going. So clearly we were needing some form of power here. So we're gonna go ahead and put in these, okay? And this will allow me to put in what well, the, the temperature thing. You know, this is what they were needing. Because I guess they were just what kind of freezing to death in here. I mean, it's not exactly the most homely of places right now. So we'll just leave that doing that. Um, it might be that I need to restart this game uh, later on, simply because, well, clearly I'm not the best at this. Barney Barn, there's no point in you growing anymore. You've got no chef. I think it would be better for you to be uh, mining, and since you're better at constructing than him, I think it would be better for you to be constructing. So, I think, in hindsight, it would have been better if I'd actually built myself a little house using wood, maybe up here. Uh, we can still do it. I mean, we can still, you know, construct a little house. Maybe um, 15 blocks wide, 5 blocks long. Yeah, something simple. Maybe one more. And then that down there. I a little door. See, because this way they would have actually had somewhere to sleep. Somewhere warm. Somewhere comfortable. Um, so they really have changed the game from the last time I played it. I'm impressed. Um, Devil Girl, there really is no point in you doing that anymore. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and deconstruct all of that. Boop. Okay, cool. Alright, so did Miss... What's her name? Join us? Or did she just leave? And she just left! She took her treatment and left! How dare she? Wow! That was a waste of resources. God damn! Well, whatever. Yeah, well, at least we're good guys, eh? Oh, look at them go. Is that not beautiful? Just the speed that they're managing to do that. It's fantastic. Okay, hopefully he actually gets the beds done. Uh, prioritize working on bed. Prioritize working on bed. We get the bed done, and then once the bed's done, you know, we can... Really? We, we, well, at least they can... Work on bed! Work on a fucking bed! There we go. So now they can actually sleep somewhere. Wow, <laughs> he builds the bed, then we go just like, Nope, mine! Okay, cool. Let's leave them to work. Looks like we got a couple of travelers passing by. Maybe they'll stop and join the colony. As soon as they see my awesome building skills. Brr, look at this. Okay, yeah, it's pretty terrible, I'll admit. But hey, at least I'm trying, you know. Uh, hang on, let me just cancel that real quick because that's too narrow. Awesome. We'll put the wooden wall here. No, uh, we'll put the wooden wall here. And the wooden wall here. Okay, so that kind of gives us two little private rooms for these guys to live in, breathe in, walk in, talk in, and all that fun stuff. So there'll be no more complaints about sleeping in the same room together or being cold. I've also got the power cable here leading in. So that's pretty good as well. So the issue we're going to run into now is lack of food. As you can see, these guys have pretty much scoffed all our food supplies. We used to have a ton of them up here. Uh, we still have a couple package survival meals. You know, they're, they're running out of durability slowly. I'm not sure how many is left. Hopefully they'll last long enough for these guys to finish their base and really get done, I guess. Yeah. Alright, cool. Let's continue speeding up. Oh dear. Okay, looks like a couple of pirates have decided to 
attack. Um, it's just one guy. He's called Yaroslav. That's a guy from my college. Oh, Yaroslav, you made a big mistake. Although, it does make sense because I now don't have anyone who can actually shoot well. I mean, she's half decent at shooting, so I guess I'll get her to equip the rifle. Um, and where did the other guy go? Oh, there he is. Okay, so I guess he's just chilling up there. Um, oh god, okay, you're gonna come in direct contact with him. Oh, that's not good. Okay, uh, devil girl, yes, get down here. Okay, yeah, so we're just gonna play Ring Around the Rosies with this guy, uh, for now, until we get a Oh god, he's fast! Oh god, he's fast! Oh, no, no, no! Go, go, go! Leave, 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 leave! Quick, devil girl, devil girl! Devil girl, you got this! You got this, girl! Come on, come on, come on! We can beat this guy! If we do successfully beat him, though, uh, we can just break down one of these walls and convert that into a small prisoner holding. Whoa, shit, that sounded sore. You got this, birdie burn! Run for your life! Devil girl! Shit! Fire! Come on, come on. Oh! He was so close! Okay, okay. Bring her closer, birdie burn. Go over this way. Uh, Yaroslav! You're going to die, friend! Oh, come on! Come on, okay, Yaroslav, fucking melee him. Stab him, Yaroslav! You can do this! Wait, no, why am I telling Yaroslav? Bernie Burn, stop him! Oh my god, you're terrible with that rifle! There we go! Okay, Bernie Burn, you go get yourself some healing, dude. Um, let me see, health. Uh, yeah, yeah, dude, you need to go get some healing right now. Get down here. What's that? That is a medical bed. We'll find him. You, you are getting some healing, boy. Prioritize receiving treatment. Ah, shit! Okay! Now, Yaroslav over here had a knife and some medicine, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and unprioritize that. Uh, what was he good at? He was a semi decent person! So, what I am going to do then is I'm gonna go ahead and deconstruct that. I'm gonna prioritize Devil Girl to do that, and then I'll get her to do. Come on, do it! There we go, awesome. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and force her to put in a bed real fast and then a door. Now, I know it might seem strange that I'm doing it like this, but I'd like to keep him alive. You know, I mean, we, we already lost one guy. We, I don't want to lose another, so you probably don't work on the bed. And, uh, let me see. How you holding up, buddy? Uh, oh, he's in severe pain? He's also losing a lot of blood. Okay, so we're really, we're gonna to want to speed up her construction here. Come on, wait, where'd she go? Okay, you know what, while she's coming over here, fuck it, heal him. Uh, prioritize treating him. Okay, now the reason why we're doing this, as I said before, is, you know, he need, we need that other guy alive, but we also need Bernie alive. I mean, there's no point having him alive and Bernie being dead, you know? Okay, prioritize constructing that. We got that done, let's see, what's this? A new area has been... Oh, yeah, that's that. Okay. <laughs> okay, cut it again! Alas, our attempt failed. He died. Oh well, yeah, no biggie, he just died. <laughs> uh, we have this area here though, just in case we ever do want to make another one. So that's always going to be good, all that. Awesome. Alright, so that's, that's going to be useful in the future. So, uh, how you doing buddy? How's your health? Uh, he's been patched up, he's doing good! Okay! That's awesome! Alright, doing good there. So we now have a solid house, you know, we just need him to prioritize working on that one. Once he's done that one, then that will seal off as well. And they actually have full houses that they can live in, somewhere they can be secure. Which might be helpful. You know, helpful for their well, later survival, I guess. Alright. Let's uh let's watch these guys and do their thing. Hopefully they finish off that power conduit quickly as well. Where are you going, party bird? What you get? Um, wait, seriously, what's he doing? Really? You went all the way over there just to get food? 
Wow, you're dedicated. He you really likes his food. Okay, so good news is we now have a base. Bad news is we lost me. I died. Yeah, you know, that's kind of really bad. But ooh, hi. Oh, that's gonna be useful. Wait, oh, marble. Never mind. Okay. Well, I'll do it for this first episode of uh, RimWorld. It was a steep learning curve. Very steep learning curve. Um, so hopefully we'll actually survive. <laughs> God knows. We will see. We just set that as non-medical. And we're going to wrap up this episode. So hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, be sure to like, subscribe, share it with your friends, share it with your neighbors, share it with your family. Rip open your window and scream into the world. Icy doing the world. I'll catch you guys next week. Bye bye.